Assalamu alaikum. This is Najib from Algeria. And in this video, I want to show you my uh, EDF C code, C program, that implemented the earliest deadline first scheduling algorithm. Okay, so uh, I already uploaded two videos, two examples scheduling uh, a system using EDF. So in this video here, so of course you can download uh, my code. Okay, so you will find a folder here. So because but you must know how to use my my program. Okay, because here we will write the system in txt file and the system read this uh, the code read the system from the txt file and write the output here. Okay. So if you want uh, at first I just want to say if you want me to change the program for you for example if you want to change the input format or anything anything in this program you can contact me just put your comments in the description and uh, in the comment side uh, section below okay so let me show you how my program work <clears throat> so that's the program so what we want to do we want to write the system here i will explain it how to write your system here for example given this example here so at first in the first line we we'll write the number of processes here for example i have three processes so i have three here and then write the capacity and then the the deadline and then the period so that's the capacity and deadline and then period and then that's the capacity deadline and period and that's capacity deadline first of uh period of the third process okay so let's write this together this system here so we have three processes so that's a three and so let's write the capacity of the first one and new line the deadline is a seven and the period is 20 here okay uh so for the second one the capacity is two the deadline is eight and the period is 10. for the third one the capacity is two the deadline is four and the period is five so and save you must save of course <coughs> So, and when I ran, I ran the program, the, this program read the system from the file, from this, the input here, okay. So, when I ran, so that's the execution, okay. Of course, and here also, if I open the output, this output here, so the LCM is 20, and that's true because the LCM of 20 and, excuse me, let me open. Uh, so the LCM of 10 and, uh, 20 and 10 and 5 is 20. So, and then that's the execution. That's here that the time from 0 to 1, here from 0 to 1. So we're in T2. Because here in the program, I use T1, T2, T3, but in the, in the C code, I start from zero. So the first one is T0, and then T1, and then T2. Okay. Here T3, here mean T2 here, the process two. Okay. The second, uh, the third process. Okay. So, and then the, uh, the process two, and then the process zero, process zero, process zero, and then process one, this, this, and then two of the, the, the third process, this here. And then, so here the, the process is idle from nine to 10. So if it's idle, I write minus one. A minus one, that's mean that in this time, the processor is idle, okay? And so on until uh, from 19 to 20, okay? that's idle here okay the last execution is from 16 to 17 so that's from 16 to 17 i process t2 okay 
that's it. So if you if you want any change, you can just put your comments below. Or if you want, for example, me to explain the code, also I will ha I will explain it for you. I hope that you subscribe. Please subscribe to my channel, and the, uh, the the link of this program you will find it in the descriptions below. And see you later.